So you went to Detroit? We went to Detroit. All right, and how many times have you seen the Stingray in person? Three or four. Three or, Three or four. four. And what are your what are your honest to goodness thoughts? That's what I want to share with folks on the web, and I appreciate you taking the time to do that. But seriously, what do you think of the car? I'm waiting to order one. For what we time. like is that it's all different. It's all brand new. It's all brand new. Fantastic. Fantastic. And we were, you know, we were naysayers. We didn't think we were going to like the car at all. And as soon as we saw it, we had to have one. So what do you think about oh. the new Stingray? Oh, man, I got a 50th anniversary, but this, oh, I'd love to have one of these. The aerodynamically uh, racing design, I mean, it's up front. I've seen it on uh, the internet, but to see it in person is just, it's amazing. And, uh, uh, I'm anxious to be able to set in one. Yeah. Haven't been able to do that yet, so. Anything special that's one particular feature or styling cue well, that you, you like know, the best? If you look at all the changes in the Corvettes, I had a 63 myself, and yeah. and um, it was a big change, you know, between the 62 going to 63, and sure. really, I think going between the 13 and uh, 2014, there's about that much, much of a change. If you look at all the lines that they got on the new yeah. Corvette, so it's, uh, it's an amazing looking car. Yeah. First impressions, looking at it for real rather than looking at photos, it's far prettier, more beautiful than the photos are. It really is. I'm extremely impressed with it. Even the back end with the new taillights look better than the old one. And I had an old one, so uh, <laughs> I, I think I can comment on that. Oh, fantastic. The, uh, the car itself, uh, every color that they've got inside right now, I'm, I like the black and I like that new dark green color. The other one they don't have is the night race blue, and I'm going to take a look at that when I get back up to Columbus. But uh, if you haven't seen this car in person, you're really missing something. It's, it's a Corvette. It is a Corvette. Yeah, I think the C7 is awesome. I think uh, anybody sees it in person, they're going to love it. What do you like most about the car? The whole car. In fact, a lot of guys don't like the rear end. They think the rear end looks awesome. Uh, I love it. You love it? Yeah, I love it. I, I just want on me a little, but uh, how about it? I love it. The seats are awesome. I like the seats. They're snug. This is heaven. Let me tell you, it's heaven. What's your favorite part about the car? Favorite part? Sitting in it, I think it's the seats. Um, I just, I love the new design. Absolutely. I had to see it. I couldn't look at it. Where are you from? Albany, New York. Oh, wonderful. Dan, you have the uh, brownstone ordered, and uh, now you got a chance to see it live and in person. What do you think? I love it. It's fabulous. I mean, you ordered it off a picture, you know, from, from the uh, from the Geneva show. I did, I did. And, Talk about uh, confidence. It, it looks even better in person. It's it's fantastic. It's uh, so classy. It, it's just uh, it's hard to describe. I don't think I want to get out. Yeah. It's okay. You can sit there. machine it is gorgeous I love the accent colors yes and it's just the lines on it are phenomenal did you get a chance to sit in it no I haven't yet my husband did all right where's he at right here oh there he is oh <laughs> what you okay you sat in the car what did you think uh good I like the seats are a lot I have a c6 okay seats are a lot snugger fit and I like I run mine on a track a little bit so it just it just feels like a glove on you so. what do you think of the new stingray very nice very nice indeed. Fantastic. Anybody that says they don't like the car, what are you going to tell them? Get their head examined. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Yes. Sir, do you like the new Stingray? Yes, I do. What do you like about it? Oh, I like the interior, the way it's laid out, the dag, the seats are very comfortable, and the uh, new body style is growing on me very much. Ma'am, how about you? Is it your first time seeing the Stingray? Yes, it is. And it's uh, my first time sitting in it and see, checking out all the different colors that they have. And I think the seats and the side are quite comfortable. I got a chance to kind of, you know, use the buttons on those and everything. Oh, good. And, uh, I noticed that it was a seven-speed, yeah. which I didn't realize. So um, <laughs> a few different things about it. And even the um, a little thing on that. Uh, hatchback when it opens up, yes. it's got all the little emblems. It's the new C7 emblem. 
Yeah. So that was pretty cool to yeah. find out. Where are you from? Uh, Chicago area. Now, when you first saw Stingray and the world premiere all over the internet, what was your first thoughts when you saw the car before seeing it in person? Oh, well, we saw it at the uh, auto show. Oh, okay. In Chicago. Okay, good. So, and at first it was like, oh, I don't know. It looks so different. And, you know, my husband had actually commented that, no, oh, the back end maybe is too reminiscent of the uh, Camaro. Okay. All right. So, and what do you think now? I'm like it. I really am. What do you think? Great. I have a 73. You go back 40 years, man. It's antique. And what about the outside styling? What do you like about the car there? I don't like the lights. They need to be round. <laughs> I saw one prototype around. Yeah. I thought it looked great. What do you think? I don't like it round. I'm, this is growing on me. Oh. This is growing yeah, on me. That's growing on me. Yeah. Okay, Gene. What do you think? I think I'm excited, very much so. And if this ends up on Facebook, you're in trouble. <laughs> I don't like the C7 as well as the C6. I don't like the rear end. It's too much of a Camaro. I like the C6 better. Have you sat in the new car yet today? No. Yeah. Is there anything you like about the C7 right now? Yeah, it's sleek. It's pretty, but I like the C6 better. I love it. I don't know whether. Uh, you know, without driving one, whether I would like it any better than a C6. Yeah. But uh, I love the styling of it and so forth. It's a great looking car. Now, how tall are you? 6'2". How did you fit in there? It wasn't bad. It was no harder to get in and out of than a C6. That one, right there. What do you, what do you like about that one? Everything. <laughs> the wheels, the color, the interior, everything. Everything. Well, Greg, are you listening? Yeah, I think we'll be waiting for two car. years. No. <laughs> Next week, I want that car. <laughs> From Rick. Yes, Rick. Rick Conley. Yes. This is old. When, when they said they made an improvement on the uh, interior, yeah, they definitely made an improvement on the interior. It's just unreal the way it fits you, the seats. I race Corvettes. This seat is equivalent to any race seat that I've ever had. Beautiful car. Thank you. What do you think of the styling, Steve? What do you like on the outside styling of the Stingray? I like the chiseled look. Some people like chiseled look. Some people don't like the chiseled look. I like the chiseled look. It has just the right high points, low points, a flat spot on top of the fender. Yes. It's subtle, but you don't notice it. And I didn't notice it until you pointed it out to me. But now I look at it, it's just a nice look. Uh, the uh, the little truck uh, protrusions on the front of it at the lower air air dam. Yes. It just looks neat as can be. The, the tail lights. I don't care what they say. You know, if you want to say it looks like a Camaro, you can, but it doesn't. There's no way that it, you can compare that with a Camaro, unless you're maybe a Camaro owner and wish you had one of these. <laughs> hey, buddy, thumbs up to the new C7. Can't hey, wait till my order gets in, brother. Hey, we know you love the car, man, but let's face it, you, you're, you're, you're a bigger man. Everyone wants to know, how do you feel on these new seats, man? It feels a lot better than the C6 seats, brother. I might be a big guy, but I'm still going to enjoy it. That's awesome. I love it. I love it. So your first time looking at the Stingray, what do you think? I think it's a beautiful car. I can see it. For anybody who says that they don't like it because of the rear end, what would you tell them? Just say, hey, you better look again. <laughs> We've got to think about the future, right? Okay, Stingray C7, you've seen it a couple of times. What do you really think of this car? Uh, I'm in love so much to the point that I'm going to have to stay away from it when it first comes out. Because the first time I drive it, it's done, it's over with. The 13 Grand Sport is out of here. Thumbs up, Corvette. I love it. The new Stingray is just a fabulous car. There's just so many more uh, engineering advances, new technologies, the frame, the brakes, uh, the interior that's been looked down on for a long time, you know. Yeah. A really, really, really uh, sharp car. And I fit in it.